Chrissy, how do you spell your name? It's Chrissy, C-H-R-I-S-T-Y. Okay. And then last name K-R-O-B-O-T-H. Crowbar? Yes. Chrissy Crowbar. You're good. All right, what is your title? Alligator Sorry. Trapper, licensed alligator trapper. What's the, uh, y'all's company, y'all's Gator Squad. Gator Squad, there we go. So, Chris, uh, Chris, you talk to me about today. Uh, y'all got called out here. What, what, what'd you find when you got here? Yeah, okay, so we got a call out here to Lake Point Golf Club. Uh, we got here, and the call came in as a 12-foot alligator on the golf course. They were just, um, uncomfortable with it. Uh, they took us out to hole 17 where the gator was and yes they were exactly right it was a huge 12 foot alligator he is a male alligator probably about six to seven hundred pounds um, he was laying on the shoreline just catching up some sun um, the report was that you know golfers weren't being too nice to him golfers were getting too close to him and um, he was just too big they were uncomfortable with the whole situation so they called us in to safely remove the alligator so we could relocate him so how how was this uh, this trap or was this removal uh, similar to the, uh, the Godzilla? It was a little bit similar to Godzilla, although this one did not take me for a ride. Um, I was able to walk up to him, put a rope on him. He went into the whole death roll thing, tried to jump into the water, tried to take me for a little swim. But uh, all in all, we were able to pull him out, pull him back on shore, get him settled down, calm him down. And we used a, a tractor that they have here on location to help lift us up in the, the lift part and bring him back to our truck. So the, Gators. I mean, it's this obviously he is a big guy. He's a huge guy. Yeah, he's good. He's good size. Is this is it uncommon or how common is it around Fort Bend? It's very common in Fort Bend. Um, the actual city side of Fort Bend not really too common for these big guys. It's mostly smaller ones, six, seven foot, hanging around there. These guys are actual like real country gators. They're out here where no one's around, no one messes with them too much, and that's how they're able to grow to the size that they are. So I mean, so you all do you all take calls all over all over Fort Bend? All over, yeah. So pe will people be surprised to know that gators aren't these like rare mythical things that they're actually like a lot of them around? Right. Yeah. Um. You don't see them. Um, gators, they know that you know people that the land belongs to the people. So gators, they're gonna stay in the water. Um, it's in, it's when people start feeding them that they get used to people. So if you're out feeding a gator every day, he's gonna come looking for handouts. But more than likely, the true wild good gators they stay in the water and they know, hey, the land's for people, water's for me. So that's why a lot of people don't see them because they are good at hiding and they are good at staying where they're supposed to be. So when um, when they uh, when, when a person sees a gator, this is the wild. What? Um, what do they need to do? First off, don't ever feed an alligator. Don't harass them. Um, don't get too close. And if you do happen to accidentally stumble upon one, they'll give you warning signs. They don't want to bite you. They have no intention of eating you or hurting you. So they will give you warning signs like to hiss and open their mouth. And those are all warning signs saying, hey, you're too close. So if accidentally you get too close, back away slowly. Don't be too loud. Turn away and walk away. Just leave the gator alone. What, you got a question? We're good. Christy, All thank right. you so much. Uh, let's say the name again. It's River Point Golf no, Club. River Point Golf Club. You said Lake Point. It's all right. Oh. It's all right. So River Point Golf Club. So River what, now y'all named, y'all gave him a name. Chubbs. What, what? Yeah, so his name is Chubbs, and he got that um, name just because of the Happy Gilmore movie. Um, Chubbs. Is that the name of it? Sorry. Yeah, I think it was Happy Gilmore. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. So his name is Chubbs. We got that from the movie Happy Gilmore with Adam Sandler. They had a big alligator. They named him Chubbs. So, of course, we're at a golf course. Why not have a big alligator named Chubbs? All right, cool. We're good. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, mention that you all have dropped us some video of the... Yes, of the actual catch we have. Okay. How so, I'm gonna try to upload it, but I'm having... We tried to upload it a minute ago. One of my cards got corrupted, so I'm gonna have okay. to get on my computer and try to get it. But I do have on this card right here footage of the gator in the bucket of the forklift okay. driving back across the I bridge. Have that on my phone. I, can text you. I have it on here. If you oh, have a PC, I can copy it on a laptop right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Let me good. fire up my laptop. Okay.